hello good guys welcome back to my channel in this video i will be guiding you how to pass json data to html template file in django project so let's get started so you need to open your project which you had created previously by following my you know django video tutorial so you can see i have opened my projects in the last video i taught you how to pass a, a data dictionary to the you know html template file you can see so to learn this how to pass a json data to the html template file allow me to comment this because i'm going to use the same views a student marks view you know i'm going to convert this student marks into the json format and i will pass that same data as a json data to the temp html template allow me to comment this port guys so i'm going to comment this i commented i have thereafter i am going to convert the same data into the json you know uh, json data structure so i am going to convert this data into the you know uh, json data structure so let me so you can see i have assumed data json data is a json data as you have it you can see the same data i have converted into the you know uh, json format you can check it out since this data structure is already in the uh, json data structures format so no need to dump, no need to load anything, we need, uh, no need to do. Just we need to pass this data as it is into the, you know, uh, HTML, HTML uh, template file. So I'm going to comment this one also because this is just, this one was just for the uh, data, uh, you know, data dictionary. So I'm going to comment this one as well. So now you can look at this one. I'm going to pass, allow me to comment this one as well, just in future if I want to reuse the same you know uh, same code i just need to uncomment so i'm going to do this one so i'm going to copy here right return render request and we are going to render the uh, student so let me copy paste guys just to here you can see i'm going to copy and paste this one here now i'm going to pass the same in the dictionary so we need this is good practice to pass so i'm going to pass this json data so we can say json data is a name and follow is a this is a json data fine i'll pass it so once you pass this json data we are going to render this tem studentmarks.html file so we need to go and check the template file studentmarks.html you can see there is some already you know we have iterated those those data we have passed in the previous video data dictionary so i am going to copy paste the same because when you run this one let me run this one on this view so let me run this one in the this url a student marks url and see how it looks so i am going to run this one so you can see this is a data we have because we have commented all those code guys isn't it we have commented those code this code because this is a code this is a data we were sending before this data we were sending before and this was the statement so i have commented that's why you can see here is a blank so what i'm going to do i'm going to leave as it is because this is no data is coming so it's not working so i'm not going to delete this one because you are intelligent enough by now to understand this one so i'm going to copy this one and i'm going to paste you can create a new template as well for this exercise but i'm not creating a new template files so i'm just using the existing one which already i have so you can see which data i'm passing here i'm passing the json data so i'm this is this one json data so i'm going to loop is this in this one in the second one so json data in this one i am going to remove all those things because this is a uh, json uh, you know json data and i'm going to just read into one variables in you can take any variable name here and i'm going to write here in this one n dot name n dot reg number n dot max why because you can see each you know here in dictionary format you can see having the name reg number marks name reg number marks so each iteration they will bring a name reg number marks another iteration again will bring the name reg number marks so we are trying to retrieve so hope we have done it save this file go to the browser make sure your uh, development server is running refresh you can see this is coming so guys don't bother about this one this was because of this code which i am because of this code i have not deleted i have not commented in the html file and this is the one is coming so do, don't care about that one so this is just simple so guys see you in the next video thank you bye bye if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and encourage me see you in the next video thank you bye bye